Hello everybody, I hope you're doing it really great today, because I am doing alright. Kingdom Expansion, yes, that needs to be on. So today, what I'm going to be doing is, I'm going to create a world from scratch. And I'm going to try to make the best empire I could possibly make. I mean, obviously they're not going to top the Blood Elves in the time that I'm going to use to do this. I just want them to be pretty good at least. So we're going to give them a nice little MNC there. Use the vortex, mix things up a bit. Just on the outside, there we go. Then let's make a small little river going in and around through it a little bit. There we go, perfect. Uh, you get some water right in there. Perfect. And then that does not need to be there. Where's, okay, yeah, the water needs to be bigger so it gets everywhere. Perfect. And I just recorded a video on the new update, so if you want to, go check that out, because I'm probably going to use some of those in this. Alright, so, first I need to drop some resources down. Put some stone on the river banks. Then we'll put some fruit bushes everywhere. Some iron on the river banks as well. Just a little bit of gold. There you go, perfect. We need a lot of seeds, like a lot, a lot of seeds. Alright, this is a nice little map we got going on here. I didn't I don't know why that's there, but whatever. Okay, let's do this. So Cradle of Civilization is gonna be right. Right. Where's a good spot for their capital gonna be? Hold on, this spot needs a little bit more water. There we go, perfect. See, I'm thinking like right. Hold on, how about this? Let's let them decide. Spawn one guy where he goes is where their capital is going to be. All right, I don't know why he did that. Okay, so he's going to settle up here. It looks like. All right, that's where their capital is going to be. Spawn about a hundred to two hundred people here. So I want them to be able to expand really fast. Also, let me turn off hunger so that way everybody doesn't, uh, you know, explode because of starvation and so on. There we go. Oh, I didn't throw seeds around, did I? I think I did, but I'll do it again. Perfect. There we go. So they have 94 people. That's enough to get things going. Spice things up a bit. Uh, let's give them a blessing. Make them all overpowered. Awesome. Alright. Um, Trinity coin, I'll use that at the end. That's a new way to destroy the entire world. So, they have this entire place themselves. What are they going to do? I think they need a little bit of stone right here. Oh, that's a little too much stone, but oh well. Still stone. Stone is stone. And stone is hard, so... See, I like this world. I think it's a pretty nice little world. Cause uh, every time they make a colony, I'm gonna like, see. I'm actually helping them because I want them to have the best empire they could possibly. Have. Every time they set up a new colony, I'm gonna instantly bump it up to 100 people. So this isn't like the other ones where we just watch them. I actually want to make the best empire possible. All right. So I want I want them to like own the entire map. I think they're doing pretty good so far. Oh, there's a the fire. How'd that happen? What? What are you guys doing? Oh. Did they add that? Slash and burn? Did they actually add that? No. What'd you guys do? What is this? Why are they throwing fire out here? What are you guys doing? I'm gonna have to check the patch logs again. Because are they doing slash and burn type of farming stuff? Like they did back in the days? Like seriously, are they actually just catching trees on fire? Cut and burn? Like seriously, why, is there, why are they throwing fire everywhere? What are you guys doing? Why are you doing it? What? 
What? I didn't even do this. What? Are, you guys are like high or something. Seriously. Stop throw, catching everything on fire. Stop catching everything on fire, senor. Didn't I give these people 100 people? What happened to those 100 people? Oh, we got more colonies now. Oh no, we've got a rebellion. We gotta end it. Alright, so this place is at 50. Which can't hold house people yet. For some reason. Yeah, there's a town down here. I'm gonna put a bunch of people out. Yeah. Um, what's the new village info? Okay, so there's no new resources, it would appear. This is also kind of part of just checking out the new update a little bit. Hey, new town, which means new people. Spawn in the lives. There you go. I said that they changed the creature age to be automatically 18 when they spawned in. Village age one. No, that's the village. I want to... That's the village info. I'm done. Hold on. Age of 19. Already. So it's already been a year since they've been alive. Must have been one of the first people in that village. So ultimate human empire. There we go. I mean, they don't really have that many stone buildings yet. And we probably won't see that many st What are you guys doing? What is, what is this structure right there? What is that? No, seriously, what is that? It looks dark. Is that like farmland or is that like burnt area? I honestly have no idea. Ooh, hold on. Can I change the kingdom color in this new update? Uh, I can change the name. Don't think I can change the color. Alright, I'll see if I'll experiment with that later. Well, that's pretty cool. Okay, any new settlements yet? You got one right here. Yes, I know this. I don't know why I keep doing that. I really don't like that keep doing that, honestly. Like it's kind of annoying. Not gonna lie. Dude, they have so many settlements. It's awesome. So the capital is like in the middle. Have a northern capital. I think we should bump this up to 200 people. Capital needs to have like at least a thousand. But they have the farm, and they, they don't even need food to survive, so I think they'll be good. They can die of old age now, and also disease, apparently. For some reason. I don't know why. Well, it's cool that they added that. Also, I hope they add boats. I, I desperately hope they add boats. That's like one thing I really want. And also trade caravans and like making roads in between uh, cities. And there's a, I read on Google Play and there's going to be a diplomacy update. No, it, was, it wasn't on Google Play, it was in the patch notes. There's going to be a diplomacy update, so there's definitely going to be diplomacy between communities. See, what I would love to see is like organized fighting, like actual people, or like technologies, you know? Like, some people say hot air balloons and nukes, that's too destructive. Like, they need, like, that's world ending type of stuff. I'm, I mean, more like building boats and having, like, navy battles. And, like, I don't know, just technologies that's not gonna, like, destroy everything. I'm talking more like muskets or, like, bow and arrow, things like that. Because you're only getting castles. Like, I don't know if they'll actually get up to renaissance era or even like fire well they have fireworks but they can't make fireworks themselves like i have to place them down and then they'll throw fire on it and be like hey like these boys up here what are you guys doing why is there you guys are like sadistic or something you guys just want everything to burn no you guys are arsonists oh no what's the word i forgot the word Damn. what's the word i know there's a word for it, like being in love with arson pyromania there we go. That's the you guys are freaking pyromaniacs up there. Okay. So, any new cities? Uh, that's a new one. So, who thinks we should go into have the entire continent uh, colonized? I think we should. Like, I could just pause recording every now and then and wait until they something happens, but I don't know. I like seeing what. 
what are you guys doing? You guys are so dumb. Why do you catch everything on fire? It's almost like you're pyromaniacs, which I've already said, but it's obvious. No, I will wipe this entire village out if you do not stop. Next time you guys catch something on fire. What did I just say? What did I just say? What did I just say? Straight up, what did I just say? What did I just get out of my mouth? All right, you guys are the land of geysers because you guys are arson people. You don't see anybody else doing that. Well, you guys got to do that. You guys got to be different and be like, hey, we're going to catch everything on fire. You guys are naughty. You guys are definitely naughty. Santa's naughty. Santa's naughty. It's not naughty. Santa's is what? Oh, Mr. Naughty is going to get all the Santa's presents. That's a kind of scary. All right. So, oh, there's a new town right up here. Wait, go over. Go over. Come on. There we go. Perfect. Spawning a whole bunch of amazing lives. Can I just mention that this new update is amazing, by the way? I don't know why. It just feels cool. Because they didn't update it. They haven't added anything really big. Like, the last two things they added were the grenade and the napalm. Wait. You guys need to stop. Now you guys are doing... What is going on? Why are you doing this? I don't know why they're catching everything on fire. That's gotta be something new in the update. Like, they've gotta be like burning down trees on purpose so they can build stuff there. That has to be new thing. Like slash and burn, farming, etc. Whatever that is. Oh, that's a cool city. I like this. I really like this, actually. Whoa, look at all the cities they have now. That's awesome. We're gonna use the infinity point at the end, by the way. That's how we're gonna. The Thanos is gonna come. Him and his eggplant and watermelons are gonna be like, hey, we're gonna Thanos this place. Alright, so there's a bunch of new cities popping up, and that's awesome. So now I don't think there's gonna be that many new cities that pop up. Unless this guy, since I just spawned outside, is gonna run in here and try to kill people. Are they? Can't tell. What are you guys doing? Stop this. Stop this madness. Stop this insanity. Just stop. It's time to stop. Hey, look, a castle. You know what I gotta do if there's a castle, though. Obviously, I have to make it walk and try to kill me. Like, obviously. <laughs> They're just beating a castle to death. Oh, no, it's eating them. Ah. Well, oh. oh. That was a lot of people under that castle. That's kind of scary. And yeah, that's the first town that actually gets stone stuff. I don't know why. I don't know why nobody else is. Well, this town over here is kind of... No, that, not this, not this town. You guys are dumb up there. So are these guys kind of... They're just setting everything on fire like, a hey, a fire. Guys need to grow up and learn just to, you know, instead of burn down the whole forest. Well, instead of burning down the forest, you need to cut the trees down and then use them for lumber. So that way you can make coffee tables. And you know what you said on coffee tables? Yes, it's coffee. What else did you say on a coffee table? Your feet? No. Coffee tables you don't set your feet on. That's sarcasm, by the way. Everybody sets their feet on coffee tables. Oh, uh, that's pathetic. Okay, here we go. Come on. Perfect. Absolutely perfect. I love the way that this continent turned out looking, by the way. Like, not necessarily the cities, but, like, just the look of the continent in general. I should have saved before I actually started putting people here. But, oh, well. <sighs> so, today is Christmas Eve, or whenever I'm recording it, it's Christmas Eve. I really hope everybody has an amazing Christmas. I know I've said that in the last few videos, but seriously. I just have a lot of time, free time right now. So, like, I'm not really doing anything. So I have a bunch of time to just record videos. Which I'm ha- What are you doing? No, no, hold on, hold on. You guys need to just stop. It's time to stop. 
all right? It's just time to stop. Just stop burning everything. There's no purpose. There's no point. All the trees are burnt. All right, just don't do that. Okay, yeah, hold on. You know what? They have enough people. I'm going to leave them to their own devices. All I'm going to do is keep spawning them. Okay? But that's all I'm going to do. But yeah, I'd love it if they could make bridges and things like that. Like, that would be awesome if they could make bridges. Like, bridges from Death Stranding. Like, just build huge underground complexes. Now, that'd be a dwarf thing. Imagine if they added, like, subterranean stuff. Like, in, uh, Warhammer. Like, fantasy. That'd be kind of cool. I doubt it, because that's kind of really weird to do. Like, that would be really weird to do in a 2D, 2D game. 2DDD. -D -D. I don't know why I said that. It's like two DDDs fighting to the death in Smash Brothers. Uh, definitely, uh, my friend would win, obviously. I suck at DDD. Wait, that sounds wrong. Okay. Oh, God. I'm going to stop with that for a second. So this town is the one that needs to expand some more. This is just that one town. Otherwise, this would be the perfect human empire. Okay, so here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to go ahead and stop for a second. Then I'll come back in about 15, 20 minutes, and I'll show you guys what the town looks like then. And, uh, yeah, see you all in one second. Bye. Okay, so I've let it go for about another 10 minutes, give or take a little bit. I also spawned in a bunch more people. So let's go ahead and take a look around and see what we see. Yeah, so that city did not change much. I spawned almost 300 more people in it and nothing happened. Uh, down here looks pretty well colonized. Over here looks really good. So it's just this island in the middle that needs some more colonization a little bit. But up here is pretty much all taken out already. So, I mean, that's pretty cool. I like this world. I like it a lot. Uh, I'm not going to save it, but I'm just going to keep it here and be like, hey, this is cool. So, actually, I might save it. I haven't thought about it yet. Anyway, what's a way we could actually kill everybody in this world? Plague. Okay, let's try the plague. Update time. Just infect everybody. Everybody gets infected. Have fun. Let's zoom in so you guys can see what's going on. See, they're coughing stuff. It's weird. They're shaking, they're coughing. You actually check world statistics. So, not everybody is infected. There's only like 60 people that aren't. Which is a miracle. It was probably the people that are swimming back and forth between plate cities for some reason. Hey, people are starting to die. Alright, plague is takes way too long. Um, what's something else? What's something new? Um main coin. You guys will love this. Killed just half of everybody in the entire world. Exactly half. Half of everyone in every settlement. So it just went from like almost two thousand to down to there. So every a lot of people just died. Let's do that again. Perfect. 420. That's the perfect amount. <laughs> Removed exactly 420. That's actually amazing. Let's just do it like four times. See what happens. Three, four. One, two, three, four. Perfect. How many people are even left? 21. So, oh, this uh, entire city was wiped out. Wait, I didn't mean to do it again. Stop. No, I, I don't want to do it again. Stop. Stop. Where's the, where, where's it at? There we go. Perfect. I don't want it to happen again. This is enough people to recolonize the world someday. Someday the world will be recolonized. Okay. How'd this entire city just remain untouched for the most... Most part. Oh no, every single other city has been destroyed. Probably because of the plague. Does everybody here have the plague? No. I don't think. Nobody has the plague. So Thanos has spared the entire world from the plague. So, yeah, that was awesome. I really liked doing this video. 
And if you want to see something similar like this, then leave a like, I guess. That can show me how or whatever. If you want, it doesn't matter. I like doing these, so I'll probably do some more like this anyway. That was, I don't know why I did that. Anyway, uh, hope you all enjoyed. If not, I'm sorry. Oh, well. And uh, see you all next time, and hope you have an amazing rest of your day. Bye.